just venturing out to get some dinner and having a look at the pool area at night and it looks like some people have finally arrived so I'm not the only one here there's some lights on upstairs there so it looks like there might be one other group of guests staying in one of the rooms rather than just me here by myself so there it is the emerald I don't know if you can read that, it says Emerald Residence. So the, one of the problems with it is that it's a little bit far out and as you can see there's when you normally stay in hotels, and there's two cities I've been in and normally there's tuk-tuks out the front and lots of action and but here there's nothing, you've just got to walk. You've just got to walk yourself into town and I don't really know where I'm going so it'll probably take me a fair while I'm walking. So I've walked from my hotel through the streets in the city now down to the waterfront on the river And as you can see, camp, I keep getting the name mixed up, I always get confused with Canton, <laughs> but it's Camp Pot here in Cambodia. And of course, being an Asian country, everything's lit up at night. Over the, over the water there, it says, welcome to Camp Pot Province in big, big bold lighting and then right along the waterfront here it's all lit up that's the bridge over there that crosses over over the river and the businesses light themselves up as well the restaurants Looks, looks very attractive. Is it a beautiful city during the day? Of course not. Camp Pot is not a beautiful city during the day. You know what I mean? It's, 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 there's, there's a lot worse cities around. It's, it's a small city. But now at night, the way the lighting is like this in the street and all the trees lit up, all the businesses lit up, the bridge, etc. It looks like something. It, it looks spectacular. You know what I mean? It gives people a buzz. It, it just makes everything look a lot smarter and more lively. After I finished with the tuk-tuk drive of the day, he dropped me off in, just along here to one of the pubs along the front here and I had a couple of beers. Met a guy from Sweden, one from Canada who was sitting there having a beer to chat with them. They they come here regularly. They're here for about a month's holiday. They've come here many times before, so they say it's a great place to come. It's cheap. It's cheaper than Thailand, Vietnam, so they can prepare to come here more often. But I'll try and find one of these places along here to have something to eat. The place here on the waterfront looks quite good. 
I don't know if you can see too much with the light, but I'm just walking slowly along the front, coming up to an intersection here. There's an intersection there with streets down there. Come here during the day, you don't even know all those wires are up there. But all those wires up there, the whole street's lit up above the bitumen drive. That looks quite nice. This building here is over the waterfront, sitting over the water. Over the road's a nice looking restaurant there, but on so is this street, the street's lit up as well. Yes, yeah, so I was having a chat with the two guys, one from Sweden, one from uh, Canada. There was a whole lot of other uh, English blokes having beer. It was hot today, it looked like, it, it felt to me like 37 degrees, 38 degrees today. It felt hotter here than it has in Siem Reap when I was there for the last six days. Just walking along here tonight, the air, you feel like you can cut it with a knife. Very, very, still very warm and very humid. The air's thick, so everybody just, nobody's got long pants on, everybody wears shorts. Just stopped in this little restaurant here, have a look at the prices for you. Chicken cord on blue, five dollars fifty or twenty-two thousand real. Seafood coconut. Fried shrimp pepper, four dollars. Chicken parmesan, five dollars. Noodle soup, two dollars seventy-five. Very cheap. I'm having spaghetti bolognese, four dollars. Sixteen thousand Cambodian real. Spaghetti alla carbonara, four dollars. Pizzas, lots of pizzas. Margarita, five fifty for medium. Burgers, four dollars fifty roughly for a burger. Grilled. Fried fish, four fifty. Deep fried shrimp, five dollars. Shakes, dollar seventy five. Juices, two fifty two dollars. Tiger big bottle, two dollars fifty. Coke, one dollar. Amgori Cambodian beer, 75 cents. Very cheap. 